How different would the fabric of the world look if all business embraced spiritual principles? All the justifications and rationalizations for poor-in-spirit decisions regarding layoffs, exorbitant executive salaries, pollution, leaving communities they have been a part of for decades just to improve the bottom line, many more, would evaporate like morning dew on a desert flower. To be clear, change is natural. People who perform at exceptional levels should be well compensated within reason. If a business is not profitable or healthy, it should and must change. It is the manner in choices in change that matter. Hinduism teaches that one should always treat others as they wish to be treated. This simple, straightforward spiritual principle or golden rule is central to our spiritual path and, though first recorded over 5,000 years ago, is routinely ignored. If business and governments employed just this single spiritual pillar, the world would be transformed overnight. Now, if you've not invited God into your business, do not lose any more time. Living on the spiritual basis, you have tapped a resource of unimaginable depth and power. Yet many who adhere to spiritual principles in their personal life allow themselves to waver when it comes to business. Now, the reasoning is simple. The competition does not employ these principles, and the fear is that if they do, they will be handicapping themselves unfairly. Is it really any wonder, then, when spiritual principles like the Golden Rule are absent from the majority of secular business decisions? Once again... Burn this into your consciousness. There is no secular. Everything and everyone are part of the divine. Everything and everyone connected in spirit. All supposed divisions are merely convenient illusions to perpetuate the false belief that there are areas of our lives that are not God is not involved in or a party to. So we must seek his guidance and love in the workplace if we're to truly live on the spiritual basis. Whether we clean the executive washroom or rule the boardroom, deliver the mail or pass judgment from the highest court in the land, the path requires we weigh every decision and choice in spiritual light and lean on the greatest partner we will ever have because in God we trust is not situational and it is the one true path of real success. My name is Vincent Lee Jones. You can find my writings and videos on Blogger. Title of the page, Living in Spirit. You can find them as well on Facebook at Miracles of Recovery. If you search Vincent Lee Jones, you'll find them on YouTube, LinkedIn, Facebook, and Vimeo as well. Have a blessed day.